Next today, he's the ex home and away star who effortlessly made the transition to some of Hollywood's biggest blockbusters. Glenda caught up with Aussie hunk Chris Hensworth to talk about his latest role alongside Charlize Theron in Snow White and the Huntsman. The Queen demands your presence. Can't you see him having a bath? Well, he nearly said no to the role, but thankfully after reading the script, Chris Hemsworth jumped at the chance. I sat down with the Australian actor to find out how he got on. That was great. Um, it, initially, when it was pitched to me, I wasn't, didn't have a big interest in, in being involved. I said, oh, no, I've seen that story, I've heard it before, and, and it's nothing new, but reading the script was, um, it was, it was far different to anything I've seen of this, this story before, and edgier and darker, and, and uh, far more sort of epic on scale than the Disney cartoon. Of course, than the fairy tale. Yeah. And um, I'd say every day on set was tough for you because like there's not one scene that you're not kicking ass in some shape or form. <laughs> like when you left the set every day, were you wrecked from it or are you used to it at this stage? You're a fit guy, so. Uh, no, I was wrecked. I mean, it was, um, I, I had to sort of <laughs> come off set and then try because I was trying to lose weight for the next film I was going to do. So it was oh. sort of, um, it was hard, it was really cold too, and what have you, but I mean, look, there's, it's a hell of a amount of fun too, you know, yeah. but it is certainly, you know, there's times when it was pretty, you know, pretty draining, but, um, geez, I mean, it's like we've, I think as kids, run around the backyard, swinging sticks and whatever, pretending to be a soldier or a huntsman, and, and this was yeah. just like being a big kid again. Of course. And can you bring us through that scene of being hanging out of the tree with Kristen? Oh, yeah. Um, you got a punch as well while you yeah, were... Yeah, right. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I, I, that was brutal, that scene. It was... Um, you were literally hung upside down all day. Which is bad enough. Which is... You try doing that for 10 seconds, let alone, you know, 12 hours or something, and... Um, I just felt I had vertigo afterwards. I was just I felt sick, and I was sort of, you know, uh, one more take, I back up again, and your, your blood's rushing to the airhead, and you can see both of us have incredibly red faces, and it looks like our heads are about to explode. Wow. And if we, we were doing the scene, and and each take, I could feel her fist getting kind of closer and closer, and I was like, I should say something, but no, like if she hit me, she's tiny, she's just not going to hurt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then bam, I was like, well, I'm cut, I'm done. That's <laughs> I no more that. of that. Was, <laughs> and listen, you have a big following in Ireland. Have you any plans to come to Ireland, do an Irish movie? You said you have a friend in Ireland. Yeah, Could I'd love to. Would you not get you over? Yeah, I'd love to. A buddy of mine from Limerick. And, yeah. Uh, there's also some great surf in Ireland, and, and yeah, and um, I'd love to, I'd love to. I'm, I'm here in London at the moment, so it's, it's uh, it's, it's closer than I've been it's 50 before. 50 minutes across the right. pond, you've got to so make it I've got over. no excuses now. Listen, well, congratulations Thanks and well done. You deserve all this Thanks success. Thanks, Cheers. Thank you very much. Snow White and the Huntsman is in cinemas nationwide. Let them come. <laughs>